Hi friends, so it's Miss Rice with you and I have an equation today that we're going to work on. We are going to add three two digit numbers. So as you can see, I have the number 34, I've got 12 and I'm gonna add 43. So friends, to make this something that I think that we could do in, real, in the real world is I like to think about things that you might buy. So um, just think about if you have maybe 34 pencils, maybe you're buying pencils for a couple um, different classes. So I'm gonna start with 34 and I'm gonna put it right here on my number line. So as you see, I've got 34 plus 12 plus 43. Remember, it doesn't matter which number we start with when we are adding. So I'm gonna start with 34 and I'm gonna put it right here on my number line. Okay, so the next number I'm gonna add is 12. And I know that 12 has one 10 and two ones. So let me go ahead and get that. So there's a 10 and then there's my two ones. Okay, so that's plus 10 and these are my ones. So I know that 34 plus 10 is gonna be 44 plus one more is 45 and one more is 46. So that's where I am right now. Now I've got to go up here and grab my last number, which is going to be 43. So I'm gonna think about how many tens are in 43. I know that this is the tens place and there's a four. So there's four tens and then there's three ones. So let me go put that on my number line. So I've got 10, 20, 30, 40, and I've got three ones, one, two, three. Okay, so I have to remind myself that this is adding 10 each time and then my ones. All right, so if I'm at 46 and I add 10 more, that would go right up to 56. And then 10 more would be 66 and then 76 and then 86. Okay, so now all I have left to do is add my ones place. So I was just at 86, so this is going to be 87, 88, and 89. So 89 is where I'm going to stop, okay? So 89 should be the answer if I work each strategy and I get the same answer every time. So I'm going to look at my tens and my ones. So these are representative of a 10. These little circles are representative of ones. So I'm going to add all of the ones together. So I know that that's three, and this is four and five, six, seven, eight, okay? So, oh, wait a minute, I forgot to add one more. So nine, 34. So I've got a nine in the ones place, okay? So let me go add my tens. There's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, okay? So it looks like I've got 89 again. So I had 89 using my tens and my ones, and I had 89 using my number line. So the last part that we're gonna work on today is we're going to use um, place value. So I know that 34 is just 30, and I know that it's four, okay? I know that 12 is just 10 plus two. And I know that 43 is 10, 20, 30, 40 plus three. So I'm gonna go back down here. So I'm at 40 plus three. So all I need to do are to add all my ones together. I know that four plus two is six and six plus three more is nine. Okay, so I got that part. And I know that 30 plus 10 more is 40 and 40 plus 40 more is going to be 80. So 80 plus nine equals 89. So I've gotten 89 three times, I got it there, got it here, and I had it on my number line. So I'm gonna add it up here to my answer. So my answer is 89. 
So that's the reason why we want to use different strategies when we are adding and subtracting to make sure that our answer and the way that we arrived at our answer is the correct way. All right, friends, we're going to practice more of these very soon.